Welcome back to our channel today. I will show you how to create product boxes in WordPress without using any third-party plugin. I have already created a dummy blog post, and in it, I will also create an affiliate product box. Next, add a block of columns and choose a variation with one column. Add an image block within a column block and choose or upload media. Set image alignment to align center. Go to the sidebar and adjust the height of the image to 130 pixels. Add a heading block below the image block. Write a heading content on it. Click Align Text option and set heading alignment to Align Center. You can also change a heading level to H3. Open the sidebar setting panel. Setting the heading font weight to semi-bold would look cool. Now you can also add a font size to 18 pixel. Click on Dimensions, then choose Margin and add some vertical margin to it. Add row block below the heading block. Add a paragraph block inside the row block. Go to copyglyphs.com, where many glyphs are available for copying for free. You can search for star glyphs and click on them to copy. Paste the glyph here five times within the paragraph content. Open the sidebar setting panel. Add star rating icon text color. Set font size to 20 pixels. Add one more paragraph block inside the row block. Add star rating number here. Open the sidebar setting panel. Set font size to 14 pixels. Select the row block and set row justification to justify item center. And set block spacing to 10 pixels. Add the list block below the row block. Add product list on it. Set 15 pixels font size. And you can also add a padding left 20 pixels. Add the buttons block below the lists block. Add button text and adjust the button width to 100% if needed. Adjust the padding of the button to 8 pixels vertically and 18 pixels horizontally. Select the single button block and duplicate it. Change the second button text. Set the background and text color of the button block individually.
Select the Buttons block. Set the font size of the buttons to 14 pixels. Select the column block and go to the sidebar settings panel. Add a one pixel border to it. And set all side padding to 15 pixels. Go to the options panel or find the option in the top toolbar. Then click on it to see the duplicate option. Click on it to duplicate the column block. After doing everything, publish the page and then preview it on the front. And there you have it! You've successfully created an affiliate product box in WordPress using Gutenberg blocks. If you found this tutorial helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more WordPress tips and tutorials. Thanks for watching.